Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Len, and in today's lesson, let's talk about the phrasal verb with turn. And if you would like to know more about phrasal verb, you may check on my playlist. Alright, so moving on to the first phrasal verb, we have turn on. Okay, so this is a common phrasal verb. So if you turn on someone, it makes you feel really exciting or attracts you. For example, he's such a lover boy and gentleman. I really turn him on. Many men turn her on because of her incredible beauty and talent. And if you turn on something, it means you connect or start function something. For example, could you please turn on the light or could you please turn on the TV? Number two. Okay, so the opposite is turn off. So if someone turns you off, it means you stop admiring that person or you discourage him. For example, Sally turns off her boyfriend because she found him that he cheated on her. I usually turn off someone who is cigarette smoking. And if you turn off something, it means you plug off or you switch off. For example, I forgot to turn off my laptop last night until I fell asleep. Be sure all your devices turn off before you leave at home to avoid any disaster. Alright, so moving on to number three. Turn down. If you turn down someone, it means you refuse an offer or request. For example, I can't believe it. I knew Jenny really wants to get into a showbiz, but she turned down the new project. And if you turn down something, it means you reduce the power or volume. For example, I had to turn down the volume on the radio because it was too loud and everyone fell asleep. And the opposite is turn up. So if something turns up, meaning it happens unexpectedly. For example, the COVID-19 turns up without any signals so lots of people dying these days or also you can describe to increase the amount of something like a volume or heat for example would you please turn up the gas stove and if someone turns up it means to show up without any an appointment for example it drives me crazy when people turn up to my house without having an appointment ahead of time. Okay, so number five, turn in to report someone to the police. Probably they committed a crime. Example, Kate was turning in to the police when she, she saw the burglar robbed the bank. Or you can also use this phrasal verb when you go to the bed at night. I have to turn in my daughter at 9 p.m. because she needs to wake up early for school. Okay, so moving on to number six, turn out. Okay, so this means the result or end up. Example, the government officials were hoping that the new rules they implemented will be turned out into good progress to society. And if people turn out an event, they go there to celebrate or attend. For example, yesterday, there was a huge turnout of the president's speech at the Malakanyang Park. And if you turn out on something, it means you refuse the service or resist it. For example, the guests turn out the free massage in the hotel room. They prefer to go to private shops. Okay, so number seven, turn back. If you turn back, you return to a place where you came instead of preceding your journey. For example, I have gone far away from my house, but 
Ah,、uh, when I remember, I haven't brought my phone, so I had to turn back my way. Another example: the mountain climbers got into a snowstorm and needed to turn back. Okay, so number eight: turn against. When you turn against on someone, it means you stop liking them. Whatever they do or say, you against them. You stop supporting. Their ideas or opinions. All right. So, for example, there was a people power held in the Araneta Coliseum because they turned against the president's regime to have martial law. Or Diana turned against the royal family rules, so she has to remove from the royal family. All right. So number nine, turn around to start a plan or changes what you usually do, or to start succeeding something. Example: I am turning around the previous project that I have started. I have to finish it soon. And if you are turning around, it means you revolve or rotate into a center. Example. Could you please turn around? There is something in your back. And the last one, number ten, is turn over. Okay, so when you turn over on something, you give your authority or power to someone. Examples: David has to turn over as the CEO of his father's company since his father can no longer manage it. And the other one is Miss Universe Catriona Gray, two thousand eighteen, had to turn over her crown to the new Miss Universe, two thousand nineteen. All right, guys. So that is for today's lesson. I hope you learned something. And if you are new to my channel, please click the red button and also the bell, so you will notify for the next coming lesson. Please try to make your sentences in the comment section below, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.